It's a Christmas tree that was decked in mystery. The moment Rockefeller Center's head gardener spotted this Norway spruce, he knew it was the one, just one problem. This beauty was on a property with no houses, no clear owner. So before anyone could start cutting, they had to do some digging to figure out who the tree belonged to. You know, when I first got contacted, the first reaction is, is what tree? Turns out Neil Leibowitz owns the tree, which sits quietly along a busy road in Queensbury, New York. The land is an investment property, so Neil never really paid much attention to this 82-footer until Rock Center's head gardener, Eric Pazze, came around. It took Eric to look at it and say, this is a really beautiful tree. It didn't quite mean the same thing until all of a sudden somebody wants it and you start looking at it differently. And soon everyone will be looking at it. Now to picture the tree's future, it's best to look to the past. Three, two, one! By month's end, this new tree, like last year's, will be wrapped in more than 50,000 multicolored LED lights and topped with a 900-pound Swarovski star that's covered in 3 million crystals. It's an evergreen ritual that dates back to 1931, when the construction workers who were building Rock Center put up their own Christmas tree, a tradition that, like a tree, has grown, giving us a yearly beacon that shines just as bright as the skyscrapers towering high above. If it can bring a smile and awe to a little child or help cheer up somebody who's a little blue, it's all worth it. After learning his tree had been picked, Neil did have to keep it a secret for a tiny bit. No, it's actually been kind of fun. You know, listen, I'm a lawyer by profession. You know, confidentiality goes with the business. Now the secret is out, the mystery is solved, and the lonely tree that once sat on a houseless plot of land it's about to make millions of new friends. I can't wait. I know. The experts say the tree's about 85, 90 years old, weighs okay. about 14 tons. The crew wow. actually did cut it down yesterday, upstate New York. Did they put it right in water? They, I mean, this is yeah, exactly. right. to do. It's a giant tree yes. stand. It's huge. Yes. You're going to have to refill it, Dylan. That's yeah, in exactly. your job it's now. It's always my job. Yes. It'll be making its way tomorrow morning right here on the plaza. Oh, okay. How fun. Wait, here? I will be in D.C., but oh, okay. we will be talking about it. I got, okay. to write it. I got to write in on it last year. That was oh, like yeah. the most exciting That's why I ever. remember. Okay. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.